So this is the Hidden One's Bureau. I expected some sort of hovel. Some bureaus are. Others can be fitted with gold trim. Wherever space we settle, all that's important is that our occupancy remains a secret. We certainly have that here. Have you found anything helpful? Nothing hinting at Ali's whereabouts. However, Noor was in contact with someone named Beshi. A name I recognize as one of Ali's closest allies within the Rebel Collective. He's a dock worker at the Upper Harbor. See if he's in the area. He may have something to tell us about Ali's disappearance. I have found something! It seems Noor mapped out this very district. Mark the factory's area to the north. What is there? Rebel sympathizers. If Noor visited this area for any reason, it is worth following upon. Understood. These are not strong leads, but they are a start nonetheless. Fulab and I will see what more we can uncover. Be careful. Maybe Beshi rallying those men. And should one man fall, it is the one beside him who picks him up. We have been cut down. Divided. Are you Beshi? I am with Noor. You knew him, yes? I knew him. Last I saw, he was being chased from the city. Does he live? Barely. But he is safe. Stubborn bastard. What do I call you? Basim. Very well, Basim. Have you a blade other than that butter knife you carry? You may fancy yourself something bigger just now. For what? Are you setting off to find Ali? Not quite yet. These here are only half my men. The rest are being held at the Haba, further up the road. There may be too few of us to wage an attack. If you want to save your men, our approach should be a cautious one. I will go, quietly. Have these men lie in wait and escort those we free. Your kind all think the same way. But it is a sound plan. Get to the docks. Find Beshi. Thanks. 
thank you. I mean it. That is the last. I must regroup with them. You are a hound, Basim. I am only doing my part. Together, we will see the end of what ails this city. Look no further than Al Ghul, the man only spoken of and never seen. What can you tell me about him? He takes enemies of the Caliphate and makes them dig in the desert. Prisoners, rebels, laborers. In search of what? I do not know. These men were captured with Ali weeks ago and were destined to perish beneath the sands. Not Ali. He's been taken elsewhere. They marked and separated us. <sighs> Ali was in another group. They wanted to question him about... you... and your... friends. Can you show me this marking? What are you thinking? Ali and Noor got close enough to Al Ghul that he took notice. If we find Ali, he can lead us to Al Ghul. Mm. It is but one path. There may be another. I will go where these men were being sent to dig, and pose as a captive. Are you mad? Only stubborn. Here, take this. What do I do with it? It is a Hidma token. Those who understand its value will do what is in their power to help. I will send these men to regroup at the water mill on the northern outskirts. A rebel stronghold. You are welcome there. Wafakak Allah. Barak Allah My search for Ali continues. The Sharia district may provide some clues as to his whereabouts. Is there anything more you can tell me about the Sharia district? Why would it be of interest to Noor? The people there are in quiet support of the rebels. Common folk, workers, merchants. Come to think of it, Noor did make mention of a new contact. A merchant. It may be this merchant dwells in Ashara, among the dying leather factory workers. I will keep an eye out for a stall. Just a moment. Darwish! Basim? 
Azizi, I thought you were dead. I feared the same. What are you doing here? You. Your clothes. You are one of them now. How? A hidden one. Under Roshan's guidance. Oh, forgive me. This is all too much. When I did not find you among the dead, I hoped that somehow you had escaped. I spent many nights praying for your life, praying that you found safety. Today, Allah has answered me. I am not worthy of your prayers. What happened that night was not your doing. It was the doing of evil men. You know this. It is why you have chosen to walk this path. It is why I have found my way to Baghdad. Ali ibn Muhammad is brash and sees himself a great hero of prophecy. I loathe the man, but we fight a common enemy. One I must help defeat if my soul is to one day rest. So it is true. You are the rebel merchant who was helping Noor. What has become of him? He clings to life, but he is safe among our people. I am to continue his work and hunt Baghdad's oppressors. Ali was helping Noor get closer to one such man. But as you may know, he has since disappeared. He hasn't disappeared. He has been captured, a fate shared by many rebels of late. Do you know where he is being held? He was taken to the Khurasan Gate guardhouse. But that was weeks ago. You even leave like they do. It is good to see you again. Just watch yourself. You may be in better hands, but I'm still a nagging old man. And Basim, if ever you are feeling a little thievish, come see me. I could use your help. Uh, for a good cause, of course. This is the outpost Ali was taken to. I saw that before. Are you and the scribe ever going to play nicely together? Not likely. The man thinks he can let loose his tongue just because of his rank. If he gets in my way again, I will kill him myself. And who will record the prisoners then? You? <laughs> you cannot fasten your own braces, let alone write. <laughs> if it means we rid ourselves of his blithering, I will happily learn. This looks like a scribe's quarters. Go, Enkidu.
That one looks like a scribe. I will hold on to that for you. A list of prisms, all paired with different marks. I were in Ali's position, I would do the same. An army is only as powerful as its weakest soldier. Assalamu alaikum, Basim. Wa alaikum assalam, Ahmed. How was your journey? I am Abu Jafar. Right. My apologies. Is there a problem? Not yet. But we've discovered Ali was brokering a deal with Noor to supply the rebels with resources in exchange for his help. The order is a thorn in his side, yes, but Ali has his sights set on the Khilafah. He will want us to honor this deal. What news do you bring? Our target is Al Ghul. He uses prisoners and laborers to dig around Baghdad. Ali and some of his men were captured and marked. With Beshi's help, I freed them. But Ali had been taken elsewhere for questioning. One of the rebels showed me his mark. If this list of captives is correct, Ali was sent to the Damascus Gate prison. Where are these rivers now? A watermill, on the northern outskirts. I will meet with them. See what more I can learn about this deal. Find Ali. The Damascus Gate prison is the most well-guarded prison in Baghdad. This will prove to be no small challenge, I can tell you. I will scout ahead. Meet me near the prison's front gate. A moment of your time before you go, Basim. I have some useful thoughts to share. You have my ears. First, I have fashioned a board with information brought to us by our spies around the city. Consult it at your leisure. Second, these lands are ripe with materials to improve your weapons. See the blacksmith Jawar nearby. He could help you. And lastly, I am your man for any tool enhancement. Bring me materials and you will see what mastery I can provide. Resourceful as always. My thanks, Abu Jafar. There it is, as cruel and unforgiving as I remember. You were once imprisoned here. Oh no, I have never been inside. In fact, I have never stood closer than this very place. It was from here that I would fly my kite high over these prison walls. It had a unique pattern, you see. One I stitched together with my father when I was just a boy. So here I came, day after day, hoping for a gust that would take it high enough so that he would see it and know that I was here. I do not know if he ever did. 
I know this pain, and I am sorry for yours. I am not. Such pains forge our paths, remind us of who we are, who we can be. Speaking of paths, I see only one, and it is not inviting. No, we need to find a way to get you inside without being seen. Could this help? Where did you get that? Beshi. He told me these tokens command a high value among the common folk. Indeed. You could perhaps bribe the guards to look the other way, or enlist the help of some merchants. I shall see what flavor best suits me. I will take my leave and return to the Bureau. Fakakallah. You are shrewd men of business. Care to hear a proposition? <sighs> so long as it is an attractive one, my friend. What is it? I need to get into the prison. Unnoticed. I thought perhaps you could let me pose as one of your aides. Hmm. Possibly. And in exchange? Token. Do you recognize it? Well, well. An attractive proposition indeed. Stay close to me and follow my lead. yourselves yes yes please give way move please I shall not trouble you further my thanks Sadiki into the lion then we go Fighting with the Amir of Baghdad back in 38. Got a spear in the back. 
lucky I'm alive. No, it took all winter to heal. Oh, where are you returning? Where do you think? Stop! Act as usual. Ali has been taken somewhere beneath the prison and lightly tortured. I need to hurry. Won't take long! I'll meet you by the tomb of Ibn Hold on! Uh, uh, in the middle uh, between us. Uh, uh, I'll come straight uh, back to the There you go! Cowards get it in a bit! How much longer can you hide, me? thought demons could walk the earth. But that man... You there, halt! ...is evil. Huh? <laughs> Lose hold. Hate that death! Is the jailer calls <laughs> us. He needs to break us. No! I already have. Stinks of sweat and hopelessness. I thought you would have had your fill by now, but still you persist. Not to worry. There are ways to encourage your own. And you are? Basim, friend to Noor. Let us save the details for another time. We need to get you out of here. Slow yourself, Ya Azizi. We cannot leave, not yet. I need to get into the guards' quarters. What for? It is Al Ghul you are after, is it not? The guards of this prison serve him. 
They take shifts escorting groups of prisoners to dig sites under the cover of night. If we can find their orders, we may know where Al Ghul is going next. Is that reason enough? Stay close to me, stay low, and do not. St oh, come, Basim. I know how to defend myself. Really? What with? Let's try not to get in each other's way. Tell me, Basim, because I must know. Just how did you make it down here? Easy. I sucked in my belly and wiggled through the cracks. Take it as a compliment. I know your kind like to frolic in the dark, but even the world's greatest thief... Ali, one day I will tell you all about my past. Then you will understand. Such a tease. We will not have much time. Ugh. Break it down! Oh. Ali! I heard you! Over there! By the armor! <laughs> Hurry! I have it! Take it to Roshan, my master. She is with your rebels at the Watermill stronghold. I will slow the guards. Now go! No! Good! Stay strong! <laughs> right! <laughs> Until I change that, I should not regroup with Ali. The risk is too great. I need to get ahead the late long enough. I should find Ali and see what we can learn about Al Ghul. <clears throat> this looks like the place. Now, where is Ali? It was through the... All credit where it is due, for this man came to my aid at my darkest hour. And from what I have heard, I am not the only one. <clears throat> I will pay a great tribute to you in a chronicle of our exploits. But we must first write the end of it. Come.
I see you two have met. Only briefly. But the night is young and there is much to discuss. About what you can procure for me. Our means are limited. But rest assured, I will listen to your needs, Ali. Later. Share what you know about al Ghul, so that Basim may do what he's come here to do. Yes, yes, yes. Your affairs before mine. But just this once. al Ghul sends orders to the prison guards detailing where to dig around Baghdad. But it's not just prisoners he's using. There is a promissory note for workers here. It looks like al Ghul arranges to purchase migrant laborers as well. Who in Baghdad could make these sorts of arrangements without raising suspicion? There is but one man, Masoud al Yaqub. He runs Baghdad's soap mills, finds paying work for foreign settlers, most of them Persian. So he forces these laborers into working his dig sites, all under the guise of providing them with a livelihood. <gasps> Beshi! He tracked down one of Al Ghul's dig sites, posed as a prisoner. What happened? The search turned up nothing. But that did not stop the guards from trying to silence us. I cracked one skull and fled. I doubt the others were as lucky. A foolish thing to do with nothing to show for it. Not nothing. Al Ghul will be at the Karwansarai. I overheard the guards talking. Of course. Merchants from all over stop there to rest. If Mas'ud is buying migrant workers, it is likely the Karwansarai is where he conducts his affairs. What does he look like? He is a large man. Favors adornments like jewels and silks from the east. Then he will be hard to miss. It is time, Basim. What is your plan? That will be for Basim to decide. Basim? Alone? No. Let me gather some men. And allow for foolish spectacle. Your day to display your prowess will come. But this day belongs to Basim. Consider it part of our agreement. Basim? I am ready. Then walk with me. Come, Basim. Their member is within our reach, Basim. And like those before and those yet to come, al Ghul's death will be just. This is a man who preys off the desperate and the disenfranchised. And such atrocities will only continue. For al Ghul is but a cog in a larger wheel. One that spins destructively. So long as it does, we hidden ones will make it our mission to slow it to a stop. Today, you will lend your hand your blade to that very mission. And while al Ghul is your first target, he will not be your last. I have great belief in that, and in you. Through all my stoicism, my harsh lessons, know that you have impressed me, Basim. The Order's presence in Baghdad and beyond rests on shifting sands so long as you remain at the tip of our spear. And that is where I intend to remain. Beholden to your guidance, Master. Do not stray! As busy as a beehive. Come. 
Merchants, livestock, caravans from all walks. And I thought Anbar's markets were disorderly. Where there is disorder, there is chaos. And chaos can bring opportunity. See what avenues present themselves. Be reactive, but patient. And trust your instincts. That is Mas'ud, on the balcony, just as Ali described. I see him. Go now, wet it with the blood of the slain. I will find you when it is over. You think your cruelty is well hidden, Al Ghul. For you chose those with little voice, whose cries you knew would go unheard. They dug at your bidding died at your hand, and were cast away like so much refuse. All to scour the desert for some artifact. Even now you haggle for flesh, safe in the Karwan Sarai. You prefer your victims chained and starved. It is time you faced a man unbound. The fire has caused ruckus and alarm. I will be watching. What do you see, Enkidu? Opportunity presents itself. Seize it. What is the delay? Oh, what delays your departure, friend? Someone by the name of Mas'ud saw fit to inspect my wares. And so here I wait. Who does he think he is? What is it you are carrying? I ask only so that I may collect it for you. Would you do that? I would take great joy in seeing that man in a fit of anger. It is a crate of silks and spices. Ready your camel. I will see what I can do. If I can get that merchant to leave, his abrupt departure may lure Al Ghul out. We will be here until next A crate with spices and silks. There cannot be too many of those around. Hmm. 
Anjan. This must be the caravan merchant's crate. Might we play for your pleasure? That's what I, I think know that it is. Is. <laughs> is this your crate? Ah, it is indeed. The guards returned it to you. In a manner of speaking. Very good, very good. I must repay you. You seem like a man who enjoys a good meal. Care for some spice? Not today, no. But I will ask that you loudly proclaim your departure. Make sure Mas'ud notices. <laughs> We share the same mind. My thanks to you, ya Sadiqi. The Sahib al Surta warns that the roads beyond Baghdad are littered with bandits. Venture there only at your own risk. The things that pass for art these days. What? Sir! That's right. Yes! Again! Oh, shape! <laughs> Pay me no mind. You die now! You will stop me! I can use this to my advantage. Those two men are having a loud dispute, but not loud enough. How might I push them over the edge? Word will surely get to Alaoul. Come out and spectate. Coward. There he is. Now is my chance. What is happening out there? Picked by my finest agent. I defy anyone to find better in all the empire. There you are. This end. No. 
سبحانك الله Turn your hate inward, Masoud. It is your wickedness that has led you here. Wickedness? To whom? The unenlightened. The feeble who have cast their lot. It is our divine will to rule over them. Our duty to exact their contribution. Contribution? To what? To what could be. The very knowledge of which lies buried beneath these sands. Some things are meant to stay that way. No, 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 no. These are gifts destined to be recovered. They speak to us, as you well know. Me? Oh, yes. The hidden one you may be, but not just. Al-Ghul's relentless pursuit at the expense of human lives has come to an end. It is a day of victory, not only for those spared of his cruelty, but for the hidden ones. The Order's grand plot in Baghdad may still be a mystery, but we can at least be certain Al-Ghul's role in it has been vanquished. I believe what he sought to uncover were more strange objects. Like the one I took from the Winter Palace. What does the Order want with these relics of the past? And why guard them with so much effort? You are beginning to ask the right questions, Basim. We shall find the answers together. Lately, all I have are questions. What do you mean? Nothing. Forget I said anything. How am I to guide you if you will not speak openly? I have... I have... struggled with nightmares. In these dreams, a jinni torments me until I wake up panicked and soaked with sweat. In Alamut, I had nearly forgotten about it. But when I killed Alhul, I felt its presence again. And I am left asking why? Why here? Why now? Why me? Piling questions and no answers. I meant to tell you, but... You were afraid I would think you weak of mind. We are only as weak as we allow ourselves to be. To shed a weakness, you must do what is necessary to mend that which causes you pain. Will you permit me a brief respite? I wish to seek out an old friend. Niha? I remember. She is important to you, isn't she? She is. 
But last we spoke, I led her to believe otherwise. This causes you pain. Then go and heal this wound without delay. Find me at the Harbeya Bureau when it is settled. If that was indeed Nihal, I have not a clue where she went. Back home in Anbar, maybe. Basim? It's really you? Nihal. Mm. I... Huh. Say nothing, ya Sadiq. I am as sorry as you. I have so much to tell you. And I you. We will grant each other an audience. But first, I must know something. What? Why are you dressed like a peasant? Perhaps I have less to tell you than I thought. I think I can surmise what our time apart has been like for you. And you? You have not been living here, I hope. <laughs> less living, more working. On what? Why do I know this? Because you have seen it, on the object we found at the Winter Palace. I have been trying to remember the specifics of its design. You have spent all this time obsessing over this symbol? Why? Because I too have seen it before. I know not where or when, only that I have. Whatever it is, it calls to me. I intend to unravel its mystery, and so should you. Ah, but of course. Duty calls. Stop. I will bear it in mind if it means you will spend more time outside these musty walls than you do within. You really do spare a thought for everyone, don't you, Basim? Araki lahikan. The Order of the Ancients are far from defeated. Master Roshan is certain to have a plan brewing to uproot them. And perhaps I should look into Nihal's obsession. It seems Nihal is trying to discover the location of a secret chamber. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Man, the ship shall not...